Hello everybody! Welcome to another episode of Monster Train. Our last episode was a bit of a clobber, so let's hope this one goes better. Let's see who we got. Please no Melting Remnant. Okay, we got Awoken and Stygian. I can do Awoken and Stygian. I really like Sharpen and Graft is nice. We got some targeted damage right off the bat. Let's hope for Spikes or the healing one. I think I'm gonna go with the Spikes. I think that's just better for the start. We're back in Spike City, folks. I hope you like it here. Spike City is a great place to be. Non-boss, enter with spikes. That's not a problem, because our champion is just going to kill them with her spikes. That's just the fair trade. Okay, you guys are spooky scary, so let's just, like, met our commander over here. Let's go like that. Uh-oh, they say. Alright, we're gonna nuke one of these just to put the damage down. And is it better to just, like, keep that she, she's alive? I think so, probably, to be honest. I think that's the way of going about this. Then we're gonna give her some healing, kill one of these guys, and then drop a train steward up here, I suppose. Honestly, though, our hope, though, is to kill the boss with this. Get these guys down now while we have the money. And let's give her some healing because she's our she's our game plan. She's how we win. And win we shall with this. Easy. Easy. She did die. But that's okay. That's fine. Okay. Vine grasp is great for targeted damage. This is nice if we get multi-strike stuff. Healing our commander is very good. We do have targeted damage, so Vine Grasp is probably not the choice here. This is probably just the best spell going forward, especially if we can get a multi-strike unit. So let's assume that's gonna happen. Um. I guess it's you. I guess it's you. I don't feel too confident about that though. All right, we are going this way because we would love a multi-strike unit like you. Exactly, exactly that. And we would love to give you more health. Yeah, exactly that. Honestly, I'm gonna save this. This plus 10 does seem nice, but I think uh, what's better is if we just, um, if we don't do that. <laughs> I know that's a weird thing to say. Okay, this could be good with you. I think that's good. I think that's a good time. We will purge a card. I'm gonna get rid of one of these frozen lances, probably. On the plus side, we have a floor. We have the floor we know we want. Like, it's we're on autopilot right now. Like, it's th this... Our deck is currently making all the decisions for us. We don't need to do anything. What we just do is we put her. We can even just put them down here, to be honest. Her, and then that. And then we just freeze you. We don't even need to do that. Let's just heal her and put this guy here. Sweet. This is what we're looking for. All right. Keep it going. As I said, we're on autopilot. I would love to have given you quick, but that's okay. Ugh. As I said, we're on super duper autopilot. This game has already made all the decisions for me. See, look at that. That is, that floor is set. We can now just start picking up pieces for another floor. Damn. Dang, huh? Dang. I'll always, always take offering token. Okay. What's our second, what's our next floor gonna be? Probably you. Probably you. We're in the Spikes Tribal deck. Let's go. I would love to do spell upgrades. 
That's what we're looking for. We all get it. So I think we're going to do an artifact instead. The first time each friendly unit uh, is healed each turn. Sure. I guess. I guess we're just going to do it twice. Copy a card, copy a card five times. I know, I know what you're thinking. You're like, Justin, but you just got one. I know, she is expendable. She's not making it. That other one is, though. Bomb blow up twice. That's a bit spooky scary with our build, to be honest. That's probably, this is probably the, the most intimidated I've been. Right here. Can we make it through? Probably, but it might not be pretty. This might be one that we need to like adapt to the situation. Right, like this. And then we just put this guy here. He's gonna just die though. He's gonna die on either floor, but it's better than having him in our deck, I guess. It's not exactly pretty, what's going on here currently. Oh, this dude doesn't fit here. I guess we're going for a size upgrade. As I was saying, this one's gonna be very messy. This guy needs the healing. And we also gotta blow up this bomb for sure because we don't want our commander taking that much damage. All right, a size upgrade's gonna be a really easy choice, luckily. Okay, we would love to draw and discard a card. This is rough. Two, he's done no matter what. He is done no matter what, they say. Rough. Rough, rough, rough. Okay, we can at least kill one of these guys, I think. Like I said, I, I, we're gonna get, we're gonna get, it, we're gonna get out of here, okay? It's just a question of how much damage can we avoid? These double explosions are pretty spooky. Yeah, see, now that we're in the final wave, things are going to be okay. We just pump her up, make her spikes insane, and we pass. Oh yeah, this is over. Just keep pumping her, always the offering token. Just keep her spikes going. 26 damage on an attack? That's pretty good. Yeah, see, he's done. 31 damage on an attack? That's pretty good. So yeah, it's... The bosses are pretty... Oh, okay. Restore friendly unit to full health and then swap attack. No, thanks. <sighs> so what we really also need as well now is some healing spells. Spells that heal could be really good here. Something weird just happened on this computer. Monster train just crashed. One second. Okay, we're back. Okay, I guess we're going the spell route. We're going to purge some cards. We're going to say bye to this one train steward. And one of these restores, I guess. Oh, look at this. Something's happening on their end, that's for sure. What am I looking for? I don't know, man, to be honest. Look at this. Yeah, we definitely want to just make this cost one. And then we're going to be getting rid of these. It's my favorite way to make things go away. It's a lot cheaper in the long term than just outright purging it. More spikes, more spikes. 
More spikes, yes! We're doing it. Yeah, I'll do spell shield. So, the next, I think the big piece we're missing is we have a lot of tanks, we have a lot of damage on our top floor, we just gotta keep everybody alive. So really our goal is just, what can we do to keep dudes alive? And I think the answer to that is, we need to get healing. That's easy. That's easy. Let's pump her up. I don't like when that angel laughs at me. She's a bully, and I just want everyone to know that. Okay. You're definitely gonna need some healing, but we'll we'll figure that out when we can. Let's just let's heal you by not sending any dudes at you. That's a good way of going about it, right? Uh, she's taking some chunks, but no one's getting to you again. So once again, we can just like heal you through this. Yeah. Yeah, we just need more healing. That's honestly the thing we're missing currently. Our damage is pretty great. Let's just get rid of this. Yeah, like this is fantastic. Draw, discard, you, heal her. She doesn't even die. But the boss is done. Cool. Healing. We just want healing. Card says heal. This technically doesn't say heal. Uh, I'm gonna grab this with the hopes of spending uh, mana, uh, spending money to reduce its cost. If that costs one, that's exactly what we're looking for. Yeah, we're gonna go this way. Easiest decision of my life right there. We could even actually honestly end up, end up holding that over. Uh, maybe not though. <laughs> Restore 11 health on this, that's pretty good. We will do a reroll. Make this cost one. To remove, consume, and no. Once again, getting these things out of here is the best way of making that happen. Making the win. All right, thanks. <laughs> But no thanks. I know that's a bit weird. I know that. I know that is strange, but it, it feels right, to be honest. Yeah, let's go for it. I'm feeling we kind of destroyed, we demolished that last floor. So let's just like do it again. Like these guys don't scare me to be completely honest with you. I want this guy here. We want to restore a bunch of health to him. And we want to give her the regen? No, we'll give him the regen. Just get him ready for the next. For whatever might come his way next. Okay. Easy. This guy goes here. And let's just heal her up. Yeah, that was pretty impressive. I'm not gonna lie about that. You really brought the noise here. He's taking six damage, so let's give this guy a bunch of healing and some spikes. And let's, what can we do? She's taking some damage. Let's just pump this guy here. She's taking damage, but we can heal her before things get too crazy, I hope, anyway. That's the dream. Get rid of that first guy. She's taking 14. That's a bit spooky scary. This guy's getting up top. All right, get that. Give me that plus 30, please. How dare you? Okay, this is our turn to make things right. Yeah. Beautiful. Just like that, things came out perfect. Give the health and the spikes. Cool. Beautiful! Alright, that was a bit spooky for a second. Uh, more healing would be good. I'm not going to turn down more healing. What did I say? 
So I'm not picking up more cards because we're starting to get to the point where I'm happy with how things are turning out. I would have loved to have decreased the cost of that spell. I could actually double up. You know, that's not a bad idea. Our, enemy, our dudes are pretty okay. We're going to double up this one. And we're going to purge you. And then one of you because you're not that exciting. Let's go. Let's fight this boss. Let's try it out. Spell Shield 5. We have spells. Admittedly, but I'm not too concerned. I'm not too worried. This bottom floor looks a bit spooky, but I mean, like, I'm no quitter, right? Uh, I mean, this is a card, so let's just take it. Here, take that. We have so much healing in our deck now that I think our master and commander can tank a few. Like this, boom, look at that. Now we consume that, get it out of here, get rid of these statues. We're gonna have to worry about this top floor, but that's like a not now problem. Give this guy a bunch of healing. Pump her up. Okay, bottom floor is done. And now we just gotta watch the healing on our commander. Easy. Champion, I think is the correct name for it, but I think I'm ever going to call anything by the correct name in this series. Obviously, obviously you haven't been watching. And the next upgrade, putting our health up to a resounding, like, billion, is going to be really nice. I mean, I'm never going to not put spikes on her. It's just too strong. Like, the spikes are insane. Okay. Yeah, we're just healing city. Pump up all these guys. They just get stronger. We don't... So I guess the last thing we honestly want to do, it's a bit strange, but we want to probably double up um, this person, our, our uh, back line one more time. And we just have kind of like a, a copy paste on each of our floors. She's not defeated. That's insane. How dare you? Okay, well, in that case, let's just, like, prepare. Just kidding. She's done! Get out of here! Okay, what would be a perfect spell for us to get? That is a lot of text. <laughs> Honestly, okay, this is the choice. I think it's more mana each turn, but we would love to consume, we would love to double up that one lady. This is actually a kind of tough choice. I think we have more spells that we're looking to get benefits from, so we go the spell route. Upgrade a card to gain holdover. Sure, let's go for it. Let's get these things still out of here. This costing zero is plus one. These, this costing one is probably good. Upgrade it with plus 10 spell power. Probably worth something. Permafrost is probably not worth it. Make that a little bit nicer before I ultimately end up just purging it. Uh, we want that uh, some area of effects. I think it's this. I think we need that big pool of health. We have so much healing. We need to be able to use it. What would we really love here? We would love the ability to have that glimmer, I think it's card, the, the heals and then deals damage. That's the kind of stuff we want. We want to make one of these quick. She's going to be taking a bunch of damage here. Actually, she's not because they die on the first hit. All right. Let's 
So yeah, she took some damage, but that's it to be expected. This goes here. Okay. This guy's up here. I would love to get rid of one of these. And we could pump her up, or we could just worry about these other guys. I think we worrying about these other guys is just better right now. She's doing okay. And once we get that holdover spell, things are going to be nice. This one, yeah. So we want to put that on her. We want to give you the quickness. I don't worry about pumping you up yet. So, like, let's just kill you. And let's burn this one. So now we're going to be drawing a lot of cards each turn. We have a lot of mana each turn. And we just want to keep her feeling safe and happy. She's only taking 34 damage from this. This is pretty good. Let's give him some spikes. This guy's getting up there. But that's okay. We need to get him out of here. Drawing him is just dead for our future. So we're going to be taking a bunch of damage to us. But that's okay. Because we're at the point now where we have everything going. We're drawing seven cards a turn. We have four mana a turn. And like we just drop this on her. And then this is needed. Getting this in here is pretty great because we can just keep pumping this guy up, right? Make her spikes bigger. And now we can start enhancing that one. Okay. We have the game plan. We have things going. Let's draw and discard. See you later, Flash Freeze. You are no longer what we're doing. Keep the health going strong. Give this guy a bunch of healing. You know what? More spikes so you can kill that guy. Okay! We kind of honestly made short work of this floor. This floor is kind of over. The, the bad guy's living. Just kidding. He's fucking dead. <laughs> He's gone to a better place. And we're going to take some damage to our core again. Another, we're going to go down to 100. Actually, no, we're not, because the boss, when the boss dies, combat's over. Okay. Okay. Uh, let's get our spoils. Oh, Bramble Lash. Boom. That's what we need. That's, that was the last thing we need to really make this a spicy, spicy meatball. Hopefully we get, we're looking for the spell upgrade now. We don't care about anything else, to be honest. And honestly, we actually even got our wish. We want to upgrade her, want to duplicate her one more time. <laughs> we're, this is the weirdest gaggle of stuff. So the first thing we want to do is make this cost one. And now let's go check out our artifacts. We're looking for something. This is exactly what we were looking for. Okay, so now what we are going to do is we are going to do a reroll. Double stack was not what we were looking for. We can make this be free. I was hoping to get a holdover, to be honest. Um, but we make this free because then we get plus one out of it. Plus ten damage. Is any of this worth it? We can make this thirteen. Double stack isn't too exciting. So we reroll. Do we have a lot of consume cards? You know, I think I'm just going to take that. Hey, let's try it out! Do I think we're going to win? I don't know. It's hard. I'm never confident. As I, I think I said, I said this in a video, I'm only confident when I see that the final boss has an X next to his name. That's the only time where I start like feeling like I'm doing something that's worth it. Okay. Hey, get the fuck out of here. I mean, I'm gonna do it. We're just, it's gonna take us a few to get there, but we will. We can kill this guy on the bottom to save a bunch of damage. And then heal this guy a bunch. The first little bit's always the scariest. But honestly, it's once we get to the uh, the last little bit of the game. And we just get everybody going. This guy's dead. Not anymore. 
Okay. Things are looking like we've stabilized. We have all of our floors set up, and now it's just about having some fun with it. We need to make sure that this guy lives over here. But we can probably do that with this. Yes, okay. I think you've got to go. You need the healing, you need some healing. You are going to become quick. Is it worth it or for like you to become quick? Probably honestly you. I forgot about that consume thing. And let's just save this guy the trouble. Okay, okay. We want to get that Bramble Lash going. We want to get the healing on you. You deserve a bunch of healing. We can just apply a bunch more spikes. 61 spikes is... It, that's a lot of spikes! I'll say that much. Much. Okay. It's all just about keeping you safe. And you can also just take some. Pump her up. Get the consume going. Heal you. Okay. Dare I say, things are looking pretty sweet. Things are looking pretty okay. Once again, just about keeping our master and commander safe. If she's safe, we're safe. All right, let's see where this healing can go. Honestly, also just getting rid of these is probably worth it. Have a bunch of health, my friend. Okay. We're probably not going to see the X here, but we're going to see a frick ton of damage. Okay, what can we do? We want to kill him. The damage just went up exponentially. We're going to restore her health. We're going to give her some spikes. We're definitely Bramble Lashing. He's done, folks! He's done on the first floor. Are you kidding me? Dreams do come true when you live in Spike City. Yes, we did it. Good score. <laughs> yeah, that run was pretty good. Holy hell. Oh man, it's so nice to light hell up again. Just like burn it all up. I, holy hell isn't really accurate anymore, is it? That's a good score. I think that's one of my best scores, to be honest. Your pyre takes 20 damage at the start of the run. How rude! Got a bunch of golden cards. All right, new top score with Awoken. Oh, almost at 10, baby. We've almost made it. We're almost onto the Inferno Cup. Look at this, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. What team were we, were this one? Heck yeah, we killed it. We slaughtered it. Seriously though, like we actually, that was, I like slept through that one. Three of these, pretty good. Just crazy spike synergy. Pretty good. Holy hell. All right, thanks for watching, everybody. If you like this video, why don't you smash that? This video is only 28 minutes long. Are you kidding me? 27 minute runtime. Score of 440,000. I'm pretty proud of myself on that one. Thanks for watching, everybody. You guys have a good one. And as always, GG's.